Hello and welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3. First things first, as you can see in the bottom left corner, it says Oathbreaker, uh, Oathbroken. And we do have this thing, Paladin Oaths. As you can see, this is the Oath of the Paladin. You have Sword and Oath, Paladin, a promise to uphold your tenets at any time, at any cost. It is a way to destiny, but it's one that you the legal shoulders must bear, lest you falter and warp into most avarice being indeed. Remember your tenets, Paladin, remember your purpose, remember your promise. We had the Oath of Vengeance. Uh, villains betray yourself, less fiends. They lurk around every corner, preying on the vulnerable and twisting the world in their favor. You must uh, you must twist a sword through their hearts. Every last one. You must be relentless, Paladin. Your wrath cannot rest, for the wicked certainly won't. We did break it when when we snatch uh, Gale's hand, and that was pretty much intended. And you will see why. But first of all, yeah, battle is over there, and when I come this way, we got our warp there, uh, waypoint. But yeah, let's get playing. So there is fighting ahead. Open the bloody gate! Nobody gets in! Sevlor's orders! That pack of goblins will be on us any second! What's going on? Goblins are on our tail! Open the gate, Sevlor, now! You let goblins here? Where is the druid? Please! There's no time! Nine hells! Open the gates! the blade and suffer its sting let's go well that is will it's a, a potential party member as well uh yeah there's one up there let's see send someone Be really good if that guy doesn't die. Ah, uh, that's a buff. It's a big guy. Oh, okay. So yeah, I wanna I want to send two people here and Yeah, the only thing I can do really is just try to No time to waste. Get closer. The moment. Uh I mean she has the action search. Which basically uh, gives you back your turn, and I still don't not close enough. Yeah, that's good. Uh, but yeah, I don't have like a reach.
Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna. Oh. But yeah, she can't jump. Because of the of the grease thing, so it's gonna be doing the same thing, trying to get as close as he can. And I guess I'm gonna send my my paladin up above. But yeah, I mean, this one also has doesn't have the reach. Oh, it does. And let's send her up. Damn, really? The jumping does, uh, it's uh, by strength. I already cannot do that, so. Yeah, that's, that's not funny. It fell. <laughs> Very well then. Come on, Starion. Not enough for men either. Yep. I know what you're thinking by the way, this guy does not know how to play these games and you're right, like uh, turn-based games, mm, this is the first one in my life I ever touch, truth be told. Pretty good. <laughs> I wonder if uh, being here, can I? No. Yeah, it's very, it's very uh, short range. I guess we can give give this one a little healing. And I fell, so I prefer I still prefer away. Cannot dash because of the uh, path lies before me. Because of the grease. Yep. And well I do have a ballista, don't I? Yeah, but I already ex uh, exhausted that. Let's see this. It's good. I wonder if I have movement for this. It's good. It's not much, but it's alright. Missing right, left, and center, it seems. I can have one HP, lol. Got no more hills. I wonder if I can do this and still attack. Yep. Ah! 
So I do have like uh Okay. Damn, everyone's missing. Oh, that's cool. Got this one here. There's this one as well. But I don't really have to do anything else with uh, a stallion. I'm assuming someone else is gonna take that guy. There we are. That was the last of them. Inside, all of you, more may follow. Open the gate. Very well. Let's loot everything. Why not? Loves of power. So what is this? Um Saving throws. Slide of hand plus one. Ah oh, yeah, so this one can put on a uh, a starion, right? But I actually was gonna buy them. Uh, well, we'll see, we'll see. Alright, and so, before going in there and continuing, we still have this thing from last episode, the cache, right? So we're gonna get, uh, we're gonna go get that. Oh, that's uh... uh... To be honest, I don't even know what this is. Stone door. All right. Well, so this is a this is a whole area that probably will have like a mini boss or something. So we are going to come back. Best. But not yet. I don't remember that one, to be honest. But yeah, it's uh, when I just jump our way up here. Balsam mm -hmm. right there. For the alchemists and such. So this is um explosive one. This one you um, probably gonna need. I don't know. Not gonna need it, but certainly could be useful. 
cold. Skeleton. Necklace matches the sigil in that case. That might be the half as we're busy. Right. So this is the thing here. The back of the crevice lies a bag enfolded in the chitinous squabbling of spiders. A shiny gold coin pokes from its mouth. Nature. We've got a minus one. But it's fine. The creatures clutch the pouch possessively. You have no doubt. A spider egg is nestled within. Right, so sleight of hand, we don't have that. I mean, we don't, uh, I just put the low powers, but they were green. Yeah, let's give it a try. It's a 15. Damn. Uh, I mean, could roll again, but says pierce your flesh and shoots up your arm and across your I got I get poison or something, right? Yep. <laughs> Let's start with a stallion. He does have the stallion hand, doesn't he? Back of the crevice lies a bag enfolded in the chitinous squabbling of spiders. Yeah, that you're handling, hoping to snatch the bag. Right, let's see. Very well. The spiders scatter and you stash the bag. Something clinks among the coins. So this is the um, This is what they they had. And this is what it was clinging. So it's a spider egg. Um I don't really know what is it for. It seems you can throw it though. So probably you throw it and a lot of spiders come out of it. Not not really sure. But yeah, that was it. And we're good go that way you know but we're gonna head to the grove and see what they have to say you know some explaining about the fight Here they're gonna explain a few things, so you probably have to pay attention. There are children here, you fool! We was running for our lives. You led them straight to us, and you let them take the druid too! Unbelievable! Right, so... Um... Uh, one fight you send it, and now you're picking another one. Tell that Let's to try the to do that. The gate. Shut it, horns! I'd be lying dead next to the goblins if you'd stalled any longer. My duty is to this camp. Oh, God forbid you risk your precious tail. But I shouldn't be surprised. Foulbloods ain't known for courage. You Damn. see the tiefling's jaw clench. He's about to erupt. Mm, take us into the stifling, to the human uh, persuasion. What? Damn, what, how, what happens now? And we got two more thrones inspiration. Mm, should we try? I don't know. Okay. I mean, it would have been funny to see what happens afterwards, but. I guess uh, 
would not have been the best decision. Right. There's too much at stake. Worried about your precious eyes, the both of you. Enough! Squabbling is pointless. The goblins have found us. At least we agree on that. Right. Sevler. We need to leave. Forgive that display. Aradin's a blowhard, but that's no cause for me to join him. I wouldn't have looked to a drow for help, but I'm grateful all the same. I'm Zevlor. Oh, this is because of the drow thing. Nice. We can ask for coin. What is this place? A druid's grove, dedicated to the oak father Sylvanus. You'll find its keepers just as thorny, I fear. Whatever your business, I'd see to it quickly. The druids are forcing everyone out. This attack will only strengthen their resolve. Mm, won't be staying for long, I just need a healer. Goblin got you. The druid Halsin's a renowned healer. But he didn't make it back from Aradin's expedition. If it's not too serious, you could try his apprentice, Nettie. She's with the other druids Bye, in the inner grove. They've started a ritual to cut the grove off from the world outside. We can't stay, but we'll be slaughtered if we leave. We're no fighters. Mm. Is there no way to convince the druids to stop it? I've tried. Korga, their new first druid, Korga. won't even see me. You, though... I know it's not your business, but she owes you for saving this place. Perhaps you could persuade her for more time to prepare, if nothing else. Mm. Yeah, I'll see what I can do. Really? We're messengers now. We owe you a great deal. Right. If we're forced to leave now, we won't make it to the city. You'll find the druids at the heart of the grove. Please, make them see sense. Oh, and if it's of any concern, you're brave to walk around without hiding your heritage. I'll make sure everyone knows that you helped us at the gate. You guys saw the drow, presumably. Very well. Supplies. So, just give me a second. I, I would like to um, put all of this to their, to their wares. Because I want to be setting it just now. Very well. So yeah, this is the merchant here. Refugees, adventurers, and even a drow. No one in years, and suddenly we're overwhelmed. Well met. And thank you for beating back those goblins. Most brave of you. Is there anything you need? Act fast if you do. The ritual will be complete before too long. Uh, what is that? Just some bits and bobs I no longer need. Right, so he here they are. This is the... Uh, the gloves that I was thinking. Not Nothing to do with the others. Uh, so yeah, this is uh, the gloves of power are for Astarion and this one I want for myself. It's so basically whenever I get shot or something with an arrow, whatever I can like uh, deflect it and I think throw it back. I'm not sure. So 
So we can do this. Now, right before. Before I have to do the sell, sell the wares and that. Obviously, yeah. I know I'm pretty slow, so have a patience. And I guess. Right. Sylvanas, guide your path. So here they are. Calm and down. this one will be for Starion. I won't leave them behind. You're going to get us killed. Other side of hands. Still alive, so that's progress. So these people are arguing. Pels, we can't just leave. They're kin. I'll not gamble our lives, our futures, on people who are as good as dead. We must leave for Baldur's Gate at once. Can we all just take a moment, please? What's the point in blades and spells if we don't bloody use them? We should stay. These people aren't fighters. We can help. Or yell louder. That's fine too. Okay, we can do the paladin. Uh, where the weak have need, the strong have duty. Uh, or persuasion. Let's try that. Not a difficult throw. Thank you. It's the right thing to do, and you know it. She's right, Roland. We're better than this. Zerg. Fine, I'll stay too. Lest you both end up with your throat slit by Goblin Blade. Thank you, Roland. <laughs> Very well then. So there's Will, the one that was in the fight. Children, go on. Give me a best shot. <laughs> Not bad. Again. You? Umi, I don't need you to be like me. You just have to buy enough time to run. Come on. I believe in you. You can do this. Right. Let's see. <laughs> You're wasting your time. Yeah, nice and easy. Hmm. You're on the right path. Umi. Just proceeding. Go on now. Practice what you've learned. Well met. The Blade of Frontiers at your... Sh the man's smile bends down. No. And his thoughts become yours. You are the Blade of Frontiers racing through the wastes of Avernus. Just ahead, a diabolical figure, red skin, single curled horn, blazes with flame, bloodied great axe held high. <sighs> Hell's great fires. You are on the ship. Um, what's that woman, the one in your thoughts? You saw her then, Advocatus Diaboli. Advocatus Diaboli, a devil's advocate, a champion in the blood war between diabolical forces and demons. Her name is Karlak, an archdevil soldier I Karlak. swore on my good eye to kill. I tracked her through the hells to the Mind Flayer ship, but the damned Elithids infected me before I could end her. She's out there now, preying on the innocent. I don't kill her, she'll leave behind nothing but a trail of corpses. Oh, uh, yeah. Let's join forces. Sorry, but there's no room for me. Yeah, let's send him to camp. Man. 
I am going to take Will. Um, I feel like I I left him uh, behind a lot. My first playthrough. So I do want to do more with him. But I'm going to be trying to cover in depth uh, everyone really. Just just a more complete playthrough. By Mordai's eyes, another one. My friend's blood not enough. Come to rip me open too. In Kresh Kalir, a formal greeting begins with a bow. Is this monster with you? <laughs> okay. Uh. <laughs> well, it seems like this one's kind. Of bad for me. She's gonna like this uh, disagree. So. Oh shower how is okay. <laughs> Should I guess that lower uh I wonder yeah let's uh let's let's do that. You dare interrupt Ooh. has the tadpole ravaged your senses Alright do it but quick I didn't <laughs> I did it wrong anyway. Let's see. Uh I will straight your ears damn. Right. Thanks. What do you want from me? Yeah. The Githian key. On the road to Baldur's Gate, n near the mountain pass. S saw us for we saw it. Jammed its blade through Yul's belly. Straight to the other side. Man, I just. I just ran. The map. Show me. <laughs> Don't we? No hard feelings. Very well. So now, oh, okay. It's gonna scold me. The last time a subordinate questioned my judgment, I ate tongue stew that very night. I warned you, didn't I? You ought to reconsider keeping her around before you she see. causes real trouble. <laughs> Keep playing with her. The teethling was clear. If there are Githyanki west of here, that must be our objective. Purification cannot wait. Purification. The crash holds the Zathisk. It will cleanse us of the parasite. By covenant, I can say no more. Did you call? Uh, did you say teethling? I am unfamiliar with the. Well. I shall not say culture. Custom, perhaps. You will educate me on matters of this... Fey run. <laughs> Do we keep, like, correcting her? Oh, she just gets mad. Very well, then. Uh, I didn't go through here last time, so I want to... Is that... Is she dead? She can see there. Uh, but I'm afraid someone sees. Well, no, 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 no one's gonna see me. It seems. Okay, for the ones that want to rip, there it is. Feel free to pause it. Uh, gonna do it with a starion. Let's see. It's a lot of bonuses. Right. Does this count as adventuring? Stop! This place is off limits. What? I, I didn't do Leave. this part. 
in a secluded place all alone. It would be too easy to do away with her. Far beneath you. Ah, the dark urge. Let's see. Okay. Um. Study. Um. Uh, get to help. <laughs> Snap your neck. Damn. Right, let's see what, what we can do. To ten. Damn it! Was inventory today? I'm sorry. Nerves are shot after the attack. Do what you gotta do. Sorry if I don't show you around. She's mm, uh, immobilized. Do what you gotta do. Sorry if I don't show you around. The symphony already plays in your head. Oh. Every toe snapping like a twig. <laughs> what? What happened? <laughs> what the hell? I okay. I definitely I definitely missed this. Uh All right. Stadion and Shadowheart still That was odd to say the least. This is where I was heading. Really? You ain't gonna shoot me. Your hands are shaking. Put it down. She can't fight back. That's the point. Get out of the way. She didn't kill your brother, Arca. You're better than this. Your mind wonders. If the crossbow bolt shot through her mouth, would she taste the metal before she died? That's why I'm a psychopath. Shoot before you lose your nerve, Tieflin. If you ever had it to begin with. Well, we just kill someone. Let's try and, and you know, resist. Paladin, the government is in need of judgment. Apologies. Should I have fate? Uh, yeah, step in between. Let's see how it how it goes. Looks like the absolute sent me a protector. You gonna kill her too? <laughs> you move. Right. Hmm. That's her persuasion. Sorry if I take too long. So I really want to consider these things. Wow. Okay. Well, I got one of those. Uh, let's use it. <laughs> You're right. I wish you weren't. I really do. Damn you. Damn it! But why do you care if a goblin lives or dies? Mm. She'll take everything she knows to the grave. Um. Okay. If you believe anything the beast tells you, you're an idiot. It's alright, Arca. Let's go. Okay then. Let's see. Tempers are rising. It's clear not everything you find is at your disposal. Oh. Mistakes have been made.
Having fun with your new goblin friend. Bet you aren't. Okay, so for the cut, I managed <coughs> for her to leave. Wanna close here. What is uh, what is looking through there? Never mind. What's you messing with my cage for? Didn't expect to see a drow in here. Did the boss lady send you to rescue me? Mm, right. Uh, who's your boss lady? Another drow. She's one of my best mates. Thought you might work for her. Get me out of here, and I'll take you to meet her and the rest of my tribe. Was the absolute? The absolute is gold from the sky. She is the blessing in the storm and the storm itself. We're burning her name across the face of the world. We are. All right. Mm. So yeah. You won't Let's see what I it. can do. Promise. So I'm not gonna. I I can crack that open. Damn. I'm not gonna. Uh, what do you say? Work with this uh, goblin or anything? So, the main objective of this paladin is to find, like, you know, the guilty. Ready to go Let's see. Just say the word. Mm. Well, never mind. So, what the Paladin uh, Vengative does, it's, you know, you find the guilty, the one that's been, like, trial and whatnot. And you're supposed to kill him. Your oh, wow. Not <laughs> If they persist. Okay, one last try. Your aggression. Oh, dude, I just realized I didn't. My God, that's the whole reason I need to fight in the first episode. So there you go. That is what usually we should be doing, but we already uh, broke the. The oath. She got. She's got nothing. And um, over here, you got a lot of stuff. And we'll see through it, but not just yet. Be patient. We'll we'll get to see a lot of stuff. But that being explained, and this part of the grove being explored, we're gonna go through all of it. We uh, need it. To, we are needing to go to ground. I would like to apologize if I'm being quiet uh, too much because uh, the thing is I really want to pay attention to dialogues and stuff. So over there is Will. He's now a companion. We can pick him up. He can join the party and whatnot. And this guy, you'll see. Oathbreaker Knight. This one showed up the last episode when we <laughs> ripped Gale's hand off. I have been waiting for you. I felt the moment of your liberation. The shedding of your bond. You called to me. I am here to show you the way. Who are you? I was the first. The first to swear. The first to fall. When another's oath is broken, I stand witness. I hear their sorrow. I see their jubilation. I guide their hand. Oathbreaker. You swore to deliver vengeance. To hunt down those who had wronged. 
and ensure they felt the sting of justice. Tell me, why did you abandon your oath? So, the reason, well, gameplay wise, is because we did that uh, to Gale. So, let's see. Uh, manage shutter and cruel and cruelty is within. That could be a choice. Have no choice. Uh, for once against my conscience, threat to doctrine, threat of doctrine and dogma, want freedom. It's not my intention. I mean, this first three can be considered like. Let's go with this one. Uh, yeah, why not? A shedding of responsibility. To know the reason for your fall is perhaps to know the shape of things to come. Take comfort in your undoing. I, like you, abandoned my cause. But much can still be achieved. Your oath is broken. The light within you fades. A new power is awakening. Tell me more about these powers. Darkness will obey your summons. The dead will march to your rhythm. Even now, these shadows gather around you. They sense the cracks in your armor. They yearn to be used, to be inflicted. So, there is two paths right now, as far as I'm aware, uh, you can reclaim your oath. Well, I'm not really sure how you do it. I think you have to go through, like, um, quest and whatnot. It's, and we can become the oath breaker, which is why I, why, what I'm going to do. It's sort of like a dark night sort of situation. Do not resist. Surrender and be remade. Though born of a vile source, these powers can be used for good or ill. Your oath no longer binds you. The choice is yours alone. And that it's it. Uh, subclass Oathbreaker. I just, uh, you have broken your sacred oath. The power and ambition only that remains to fuel you now. Get the things as we had it. It's, it's all right. Mm, necrotic damage. Each turn an attack rolls against it have advantage. Also, it has. Uh, it deals the necrotic damage on three turns and the attack rolls an advantage. Right. But yeah, this is where uh, where I was trying to go. This is what I what I wanted to get uh, my class. And once again. I really, really appreciate that you made it this far into the video. I know the first videos are gonna be slow pace, and I'm gonna, I have to like basically do a setup for this. But I really, really appreciate you made it this far, and I'll see you in the next one. I'm really uh, hoping that we can get as many things that we can do, and just get a really, really, really um, in-depth walkthrough. Of this and see yeah how the <laughs> how we do with the decisions and that because you know I'm trying to be now out of 
an Oathbreaker, a Dark Knight, and the Dark Urge. But I, I'm also going to try to uh, resist every now and then, see how it goes. And with that being said, I'll see you in the next one. Thank you so much.